Prince Andrew is once again caught in the middle of a Jeffrey Epstein scandal, and Prince William and King Charles have been left picking up the pieces. After court documents were unsealed, the Duke of York was accused of groping a minor while hanging out with Epstein. Of course, everyone knows there is a s load more stuff that could come out on Andrew. That's why William was so dismayed by the leniency shown to him at Christmas. He is utterly bemused by his father's strategy, William's friend told an outlet. According to the insider, Charles' professional response to his brother's downfall led the Prince of Wales to question His Majesty's judgment. That's not how the family dynamic works, the source continued. Charles is the king, so William has to go along with it. But he doesn't have to like it. In 2022, Andrew was stripped of his HRH status, but he often attended royal family gatherings following the decision. William and his father agreed, in 2022, that Andrew should be kicked out of the royal family. Having ripped off the plaster, you have to question his judgment in walking to church with Andrew at Christmas, especially when they knew the Epstein affair was all going to be raked up again a few days later, a former courtier said. It was significant that Andrew was allowed to wear his garter robes to the coronation, they continued, referring to Charles' May 2023 coronation. That suggested he had the king's support. There are not any mechanisms for throwing people out of things like the order of the garter, but it would have been easy enough to order him not to wear the clothes, the insider added. Aside from his connection to a convicted S trafficker, Andrew was asked to leave his royal mansion, the Royal Lodge, in 2023, but he still resides there. It's no secret that William and Kate have been trying to secure a royal lodge for their family, a source told a publication. They are in desperate need of a larger property to accommodate their household. The wheels finally seem to be in motion to remove Andrew from the property which William and Kate welcome and support wholeheartedly, they added. Andrew lives in his Windsor property alongside his ex-wife, Sarah Ferguson, and friends made it clear that they have no intention of leaving. The palace originally wanted Andrew out of Royal Lodge so that the property could be renovated and prepared for new lodgers, a source said. However, Andrew was having none of it and is adamant that he will see out the end of his lease at Royal Lodge. It won't be easy but there's no other way of removing Andrew from the fold without demoting him and cutting off his funding. It's basically trying to force him out by ensuring that he is unable to meet the cost so that he defaults on the lease, the source continued. Sources spoke to the Daily Beast.